Hello, welcome to Dialysis Nurses Supporting Nurses Dialysis Clinic, where we have coffee cups. I have different graphics for all different people, and this is the other side. The boss is here, and coffee's not allowed on the unit, so I gotta get rid of this, so I'll be right back. Hello, and welcome to the clinic floor. First thing you do when you bring them into the unit is you get their weight and then you bring them to their dialysis chair. The goal of your assessment as a dialysis nurse is number one, you wanna assess for signs and symptoms of sepsis. And the second thing you wanna do is assess for signs and symptoms of fluid overload. Mrs. Green, are you having any symptoms of infection? Do you have a fever, chill, sore throat? Do you have any pain with urination if they still make urine? Do you have any open wounds that are oozing anything? If she has a catheter, I will take a look at her catheter to make sure that if there's no signs and symptoms of infection there. I'm going to assess her fluid status and how is your breathing today? Are you having any shortness of breath? I'm gonna look at their legs. Do they have any edema? Next, I'll also look at their fistula. You feel a thrill and you hear a brewing. I will look at blood pressures, I'll look at weight gains, and then we determine how much fluid that we need to remove. Each patient assessment takes about 15 minutes. We have a med pass, which is like the best med pass ever because they're all IV. Once their dialysis is done, the machine will ring off, ding, ding, ding. Once we make sure that they're stable, their bleeding has stopped, they will get to the scale and we'll weigh them again. Here's my day at work, it's done, and then go clock out and take a drive home.